Hi right, guys, welcome back to the kitchen. Doing a quick catch and cook today. The focus of the video is not really the cooking today, it's more the catch. Um, I actually went back deep sea banking, it's like deep sea, like 300 feet hand line banking. Mr. Keith and his brother Victor and his son. So we went fishing, that was a couple of weeks ago. Now the GoPro for some reason, I didn't was wasn't able to capture the full foot, footage of the fishing action. Um, also, we didn't get to fish for long because the tide on that day it was pretty strong. Now, the spot we go, 300 feet, you need to time the tide as best as possible. Now, being weekend warriors, which we are, weekend warriors meaning we fish on the weekends because we go up during the week, the tide on that day, it was a Sunday, I believe, it was very early. I think like 8 30 or 9, you had to fish before that. So, we reached there at the spot maybe around 7 30, um, we had about an hour to fish. In the hour, we managed to catch some decent fish. A lot of nice plum head, like this guy right here. And some nice groupers. So I'll do I'll show that footage now while I prepare this fish. Um, how I'm gonna prepare it? Well you probably would have seen me earlier in the garden. I picked my my own fresh herbs seasoned. We have shadow benny colantro, sai, chai, and pudina or Spanish thyme. It's basically the four ingredients I'm going to be using along with some um, salt and black pepper. So I'm just going to blend all that stuff with maybe some olive oil and then salt black pepper, pour the fish with it and I'm going to bake fish in foil. The easiest way to cook fish of all time. To go with it, I have a plantain that my buddy Kyle gave me who I bought a, a person in chocolate. Gave me a whole hand of plantain, like a lot. So I'm eating plantain and everything from now till the end of the month and a couple of potatoes that we're going to chop up, up in the air fryer. So while I'm preparing this stuff, I'm going to show you the footage of us fishing. Pretty Sunday out, like I said, we didn't have long to fish. The current got pretty strong, but we still caught some decent fish. Started fishing here. Mr. Victor seems like he's on a fish already. Now fishing at 275 feet. Good, good first fish, man. Plumbers, boy. Fish here now. Hoping it's the same color. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I think the plumbers are here. <laughs> Target species acquired. Hmm, wrong target species for me, but grunted guy. Zakit, you want? Yes, man. That's the nice. fish we want. Could have another fish here, guys. Fish biting, fall on a reef. Two plums, one grunt. Boy. Ling lings. Well done, right? Well done, well done. Mr. Victor, you want a good fish today? Let us do about two things. Plum head and bait, boy. What? Somebody 
Come on, jocks, jocks, jocks. Lots of jacks guys, lots of jacks. Every time you chop, jack, jack, jack. Couple nice ling ling. Couple plum head. This one is ling ling master boy. How are you finding them ling ling and all them jacks boy? Well done, right? Well done, well done. Beautiful more Yeah, seen color below man. That is what we're talking about. What can you say that he's from head now, boy? <laughs> nice fish, sir. Oops. Yes. Quality, quality, quality. Quality, quality fish. From head, they're caught by Mr. Keats. This one can't be a jack pulling so hard. Plums. Oh, you feel the finish, Anna? Sorry, I got it right. <laughs> Right, clearly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one, but they had a pound, though. Good one, good one. Just a big ton, a big red so hopefully. I am big. Three pound? That big, <laughs> that big for me, you know, Mr. Big Tom. <laughs> Bring him, let me see him. Uh huh. Big one. Oh, oh that is God. plumhead. Oh my <laughs> goodness. That is a big plumhead. <laughs> Want to go closer there? <laughs> I can't move right now. I'm not down. <laughs> that is a big plumhead. Good fish, Mr. Victor. <laughs> That is plumbing. Oh, he almost went back in the water. <laughs> he almost went back in the water. More plumbing. Inches. All right, so prepare the fish, just making a couple of quick slits in it. Slice of the fish, plum head, over a million snap, but they call it it's on deep sea. This one is 300 feet. Just some salt you're going in there with. Both sides, inside fish. Very light seasoning, and the actual taste of the fish. We want some black pepper, JGM black pepper, of course. The brand of seasoning that I use. All right, so some salt and black pepper on both sides. Let it rest for a little bit. I'll blend up this stuff. Just take any bun in there, pull and throw. Rip them in half. Throw it in there. Two Spanish thyme leaves. Say, say, I feel I'm like gonna use three out of the five. Rough chopping. Some olive oil in there. And that's it. Blend this up. Alright guys, back at you. So I transfer the fish into the baking tray on a piece of foil. Foil button below. I have the green goodness there from my garden. Just gonna cover the fish with it. 
twisting real greenly. Wow. Get on both sides. Of course, inside. I'm just going to put some butter on the fish, this is prevented from sticking, make it all extra moist. Alright, so that's it for the fish, let's go and fold them up, it's taking me a 1 or 350 for about half an hour, we'll check it, see if we get a longer. When fish and foil is the easiest thing of all time. Apparently go wrong, you burn it, you do something terribly wrong. For the potatoes, I'm gonna make a quick air fryer potato. Quick air fryer potato. I'm gonna chop them up with the skin on. Chopped up potatoes. So we add some olive oil in this. Some garlic powder, GGM garlic powder. This garlic powder is the best tasting thing, a generous amount, some all purpose seasoning. This is salt content, so not too much of this. And after a little heat, we're going to have a little cayenne. That's a mix. So that's it, we turn it in the air fryer for about 20 minutes, and that's it. Good to go. Fish about 20 minutes, 20 minutes. And for the plantain, just one slice it up. I made this near fryer, so maybe that could be an option to us. So the plantain is one slice it up into chunks. Thanks again to Kyle for providing got extra something to eat. I'll drop this near fryer for the fish oven. I can have it. So if you finish watching the video, so to have finished my meal, check it out. It's baked plum head snapper, air fryer potatoes and air fryer plantain, moko, I think it is. That's a simple dinner. We red fish, plum head is cooked in just salt, black pepper and natural herbs from my garden. And then we have the potatoes in the air fryer plantain, just all coated with olive oil and treated in the air fryer. Simple meal. Give me a fish I'll try because you're getting natural taste of the fish. Normally, you know, I like to season it a little more than this, of course, but let's see how it is. So, yeah, it's cooked perfectly. Check it out. Still steaming hot. From 300 feet deep, I'll into my mouth. Wow, the texture of that fish is very nice. Firm but soft. Firm but soft. I mean, I'm... No, my snapper of a million snapper is probably one of the best tasting snapper there is in the ocean. I'm gonna try more potato just for the other sake. That effort is a miracle look up. Anybody feel to become a chef for that? Now the plantain is not fried and oily. It's more of like a much healthier version. We still get that sweet taste of the plant bread. Pretty easy dinner, pretty easy to cook, and that was resulted from fishing, hand line fishing 300 feet deep. Got my dinner, thanks to Mr. Keith again. Thanks to Kyle for the planting. Much appreciated bro. Thanks to you guys for watching this episode of Coastal Ambition. Much more to come, so keep watching, keep sharing the videos, always appreciate it. And if you're not subscribed as yet, hit that subscribe button below there. Which way it is? One way, but hit the subscribe button and share the video with your friends and family. Thanks a lot for watching. Keep fishing, fish on, cook on.